Hey, hey, welcome back again, guys. What's up, H Dub Five O, Boss One, Boss Two? Yes, it's been a while since uh, both of us have been on, but it's been too long, and we're working on it so we can come back. We got to work on the studios, but it is great to be back again. We did a Christmas special, which is late, but that's okay. Better late than never. And so here we are right now, and this is something we're gonna call Silver H Dub, and so. Um, Hot Wheels has also ventured into the silver market, uh, the coin collecting market, and we're going to talk a, a few uh, about a few of these things, which are pretty cool. Uh, when the 50th anniversary of Hot Wheels was announced, uh, all kinds of things came out, you know, and here it is. One of them is a coin that came out, which is limited, and um, I forget the, the, the car on the coin. Twin mil. Is that what it is? The twin oh, mil? this one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is um. Oh shoot, I forgot. It looks like a. I know it's a, It looks like a um. Uh, not funny car, but uh, it looks like a funny car actually. A Dodge. Uh no, I think it's a um. It's a fantasy car, I think. Oh, it is. Yeah. Okay. Well, this is the fiftieth uh, anniversary um. Uh, coin that Hot Wheels came out. I believe it's their first one. I haven't seen them bring out anything else. I think this is the first one from the Perth Mint. I don't know if that's French or from Austria. Can Australia. It is from Australia? Yeah. Okay. Not Austria. <laughs> uh, Austria. Australia. Austria. Okay. So where they eat the Vegemite. <laughs> <laughs> so it is numbered. So that does have a number of 502. Yeah, there you go. What is it? Num what is the Mid run on that. Ah, uh, shoot. Does it have a mid let's, run? Let, let's see know. if it's if it has a mid run and how low is oh, it? Oh, no more than five thousand. Hey, so it's lower go. than most most of the RLCs. <laughs> yeah. So Perth Mint will release no more than five thousand of the fifty years of Hot Wheels. And this is cool, man, because this is an anniversary edition coin, and they are sold out. So yeah, yeah. It's a nice coin too. It comes in that. Uh, um, a Lucite box. capsule, yep, and that's that, right is, here. that is awesome because you can just put it up anywhere and showcase it. Look at that. That's really that's really nice. It does have the queen on the back. Yeah, and I'm really regretting not buying that. Tuvalu. Yeah, because now the coins will have King Charles III. That's right. Yeah. That's right. So anything that still has the queen on it, I think is going to become good yeah now. it'll go up it'll be, it'll be a, more of a collector item now because you guys gonna have Charles on it that's right so the new one that they have that this came out is this one right here the twin mill and as you can see that one is a die cut yeah and it's Let's also it encapsulated yeah we're gonna open that I believe there's the vintage on that is 3,000 right yeah. oh yeah well let me get out the yeah you can open them first and uh, it's pretty cool Although me and him both question why the twin mill? <laughs> yeah. When there's so much more better, you know, uh, um, models. models out there. Yeah. But I know the twin mill is their iconic piece. So, you know, that's why they did it. That is a certificate of authenticity. You know, nowadays they're making it on top of the card or, you know, they don't always make like a letter, but, you know, they just print it on the card, I guess, to save space and money. Well, I think it makes more sense for the co op to be on the item, yeah, than separate from the item, yeah. To me, to me, what they should do is print the run on top of the piece, the actual piece, yeah, like the one of or yeah, the, the number. Oh, is this numbered? Yeah, that's numbered. Oh, let's get a close up again so I can see it. So, days 2023, it's 3,000 pieces. Uh, does it have a number? It's not. I thought it was. No, this certificate. It's of three thousand. Oh, one of three. But it's still low. So. Yeah, that is. That is. I guess only the fiftieth they numbered it. Yeah, I believe this is a different, no? Different. Probably from yeah, a, this Perth Mint, and I yeah. think this one was. That's Perth too. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, as we see in Hawaii, Perth. Perk, like the shampoo, perk. As in, in it. In it. <laughs> per, in it. <laughs> but yeah, that's nice. So this is just, this is just 
two unique items that Hot Wheels had, Hot Wheels had put out in the silver market in the coin market, and you know, we like all kinds of stuff, so we decided to show you guys this because it's pretty cool, you know. And um, yeah, I and uh, if you follow us on either Instagram or our Facebook page, I'm a little more active on those than I am on. Uh, on Rumble or on the locals right now because I it's easier to post to yeah. uh, one place and it goes to several so I use uh, uh, a manager app to post to Instagram and to the group page but also the Facebook page at the same yeah. time so I did post this there to let other people know that it is up for sale if you guys want them if you collect them go ahead go check it out oh yeah I mean at 3000 I mean, yeah, granted, it is the twin mill, but there's only yeah. 3,000 made, so can, that ain't going to last. Can you imagine if they... No, I think... And this is just my opinion on this, but I think they went with the twin mill only because the license is still Mattel's. If they had went with something like Skyline, they'd have to get Nissan's license. Yeah. And then Mattel's license, because it's also a Mattel Hot Wheel uh, card that they're putting it on. And then they have to get the silver and then their artists to put the rendering on it so yeah I, I would i think it would have been more expensive this one i think was more easier for them to get because it's one license rather than two licenses you know three. yeah i mean i just figured mattel is so big hey, oh, hey, come on well i don't think mattel, <laughs> i don't think mattel did this i think they went to mattel to, to do this yeah they probably asked them yeah and then hey mattel's like yeah you can use our are Hot Wheels because that is the registered trademark of Hot Wheels of Mattel. Yeah. Um, Makes me wonder if the, if if the guy if, if if it went that way if Perth Mint went to Hot Wheels and said, "Hey, we want to do this," and they were like, "Sure, what model did you want to use?" Yeah. And it was like the guy probably knows nothing about cars or something. Oh, hey, this is cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You sure, you want to use that one? Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, because I'm pretty sure if they went with something yeah. like Skyline, even the R34, or even the Camaro, or you know what would have been good? Mustang. They the Red Baron play. would have been cool. Red Baron is a licensed one, yeah. I think it is, but what would be cool was you can make the helmet silver. Oh. I mean, you can make the whole car silver, but yeah. the helmet is chrome, right? Like yeah. that can be like that can be like uh, proof silver. Yeah. And then the rest of it, you know, yeah, and it. Yeah. Yeah, so, that would have been cool. So now the next one that comes out is going to be the Red Baron. Because they're going yeah. to watch our video. They, <laughs> and they go, hey, the guy's got a good idea. And, uh, oh, yeah. he didn't, he didn't uh, copy right now. Yeah. Let's take it. <laughs> so everybody, we buy these, but don't buy gold. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we can afford. It's not worth it. Don't buy gold. Send that to us. It's rubbish metal. <laughs> yeah. It's yellow. Looks like urine. I mean, yeah. come on. Why would you want that? <laughs> you know, you know, silver is a pure metal. It's heavenly. It's clean. I, I was. I heard somebody mention it as an industrial metal because yeah. it's used in your smart devices, yeah. your computers, this iPad we're recording on. But they said that sometimes it's it's such a minute amount that's used that it's not recoverable. Yeah. When the device is probably burns recycled. up. I'm like. How can you not recover, even even if you were to take a hundred iPads, rip them apart down to their components, and melt it all, and just recover the silver? I'm pretty sure you could. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if you took that. like ten thousand iPads, you you you, you 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 melted it down and recovered. You can make one coin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You can imagine how much that coin would cost. <laughs> yeah. What is what thirty five dollars an ounce right now? Yeah. And you just spent five hundred dollars to get one <laughs> ounce. <laughs> But um, Oeri, I think it's, yeah, it's about 20, last time I checked it was 24 or 25 an ounce. Just so we don't get chewed out by somebody who goes, it's not 35! <laughs> but by the time this video reaches uh, its uh, viral level. Oh, that's right, then the viral, yeah. It'll be 35 an ounce. You're right, you're right. It, it will reach viral level and our vi viral status. Well, can we say virus or no what? viral? Viral. You okay. can't say virus. Viral. <laughs> viral. Yeah, that's right. All that's right. right. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, I hope we don't get canceled. We'll, we'll talk more in another podcast uh, where 
where we did get a video taken down. It was a live stream we did a uh, yeah. back in twenty one, I think. Yeah. So we can we'll talk about that because I got I told him to because they took it down first and they said just make it accessible so I can download it and see what we said and I'll re-upload the video minus what you don't want us to say. Yeah. So I'll I'll do that and then uh, I already it was a three hour live stream we recorded several videos but the first hour was us just railing on yeah because so. i mean geez well, what happened was <coughs> what we had to do and go through so it wasn't fun you know yeah. what i mean so well i take that back railing is not a good act, not a good uh description of what we're, we're just having a conversation of the situation yeah no we were talking about personal experiences yes right? and it wasn't we weren't like saying these guys are all liars we were yeah. just saying you know <laughs> We weren't like conspiracy theory, conspiracy theory, conspiracy yeah. theory, rage, rage, hate. Yeah. No, it was none of that. All, all keywords they look for when they scan the videos. <laughs> <laughs> this guy said all three of them in one crack. <laughs> Let's take down their small channel. <laughs> They're so influential. <laughs> they got Mattel to make RLC chases. <laughs> That's what the guy said. Off with their heads. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. So, um, you know, like, this is something cool. And I'm sure that, you know, because the first one obviously was successful. So, you know, they made a second one. And, and, and they'll probably make more. Hopefully, they'll put better castings on there. Cause, yeah. yeah you know, that, that Folks, this is us recovering. <laughs> yeah. 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 It, it, <laughs> <laughs> If this, they is this, other... this is deflecting. Because <laughs> yeah. I, I think I had mentioned when we first talked, I I wish they had put like a Mustang or a muscle car. It yeah. doesn't matter. Just something. I, and I, Not that I don't like Twin Mill. It's just. No, you don't. But the thing is. Because like... <laughs> I have the white one. I have the chrome one. Yeah, that's by accident because you bought the case. So you had to have oh, it. <laughs> let's not confuse facts with the issue here. <laughs> I have twin meals too. Like you know, when I start, when I first started, hey, this is cool. Twenty years later, why did I buy this? I <laughs> uh, remember on counts. Uh, remember that guy that had the twin, twin engine. Yeah. Um, what is it? Thirty-two, I think. Yeah, he actually, he actually made it a quad. Yeah, he, he actually made it. Yeah. Yeah, he made a twin engine, and then he, when counts saw him again, he was a quad engine. Yeah. Which is insane because yeah. it idled. Idle speed was 35 miles yeah. per hour on it. Yeah, that was crazy. But there was a guy that made a Hot Wheel. It was the twin mill that he wanted, I believe. Oh, yeah, yeah. I did see that one. And the guy made it for him. I forget who was the, the guy making it, but... There was a... Wasn't there a green one? Yeah. I forget the name of that car. It wasn't a twin mill. No, uh, what was that? Um... It oh. had the double windows. Yeah. yeah oh, this, man. Kind of looked like a, a a car version of the Batwing. I want to say Beatnik, but it's not the Beatnik. No, no, no. Beatnik's like the um, the dune buggy kind of. Yeah. Uh, I forgot what it was. But it was cool. I mean, the guy got his dream. Yeah. The guy wanted it, made it. It was like on a reality oh, show. Oh, yeah. Right? You know what it was? Yeah, it was one of those where they had to. That's what it was. It was the, it was the, they always had to do the one up because what it was, I think it was Gotham Garage. Yeah, so yeah. they made the show, they made the show. The guy wanted a actual Hot Wheel and he said, yeah. I wanted the, my car to look like this yeah. because that guy had the mold for the, oh. Batman, for the Futura. He had, oh, the, yeah. he had the original mold for the Futura, I believe, and they wanted that. Yeah, yeah. They wanted that, and so... So they, they could make their own. They were swapping, they made their own, and they, they made it. And actually, he didn't want to sell it, but they took it to a show, and... Yeah. I think the Somebody. guys... The guy who originally worked on the car, one of the guys that worked on the car, was the guy's son. Oh, yeah. And he wanted to buy it. And he, he that. did buy it. He offered him a lot of money for it, and he bought it. Because they had built that uh, cab over out to yep. transport it. That's right. They built yeah. the cab over, so he bought the cab over. Yeah. And that, and, and, and he had the future on yeah. the back. <laughs> he never liked selling, but the the guy offered him good money, so he sold it. He wasn't happy about it, but they still had the they still had the piece. They could they could buy. Sorry, I'm getting attacked by a mosquito because I never take a bat, but 
Um, <laughs> you never take a you, baseball? <laughs> <laughs> that's the that's the correct explanation for that. What I should have said. Let me slow it down. Sorry, I'm being attacked by a mosquito. I didn't take a shower. Oh, oh a bath. <laughs> a bath. Not a bath. <laughs> <laughs> You see, whenever I say something, Boss Juan always has the correct wording. And uh, he has the explanation for what I said. In the event, those people go, what he said? Yeah, he never take a yeah. bat. So, speaking of bat, we have this, and we have another one. Oh, yeah, we have this one. <clears throat> there you go. Yeah, these are silver coins also. Yeah. So I am a Robin fan. Of yes. course, growing up, I think I posted a picture of of me as a kid. No, I think I was a vampire. But as a kid, I was uh, Robin as a Halloween costume. So. Oh, well, you bought the truck, the Robin truck. Yep. So I'm taking out that other. This one Batman is super one. nice. This, this is crazy. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Ooh, that's sweet. Ooh. All you Batman fans out there, check that out. Look, you can see the top of the That's umbrella. one ounce of the logo, man. The top of the umbrella. <laughs> yeah, so we don't get sunburned. Yeah. Yeah, but there you go. I love this one. That I had to really buy nice. it. Didn't you get one? <laughs> yeah. And then I was like, that's nice. And then I went to get one. Because <laughs> that that's really nice. Right. Well, let's close this one out. All right, well, so... This is our rendition of H Dub Five O, along with. We wanted to just share with you uh, another venue that, uh, who knows, maybe possibly in the future might happen. We don't know, but this is uh, the fiftieth anniversary Hot Wood Coin, and this is the new one that just came out in 2024, 23. 23. Yeah, the Twin Mail uh, die cut uh, coin from Pamp Mint. Pamp Mint, no, Perth Mint, yeah. Perth Mint. Pa Pamp, yeah. Pamp.com. Yeah. I think the website is... Now they now know that we don't know nothing about what we're talking about, so... <laughs> Main thing they know. Anyway, so as you can see, Boss One moved it, and now you can see what's in the back. <laughs> oh, well, that's going to be the next that's video. The, yeah, so. that's the next video, so... <laughs> yeah. So anyway, just, just a small disclaimer, all our opinion shared on this is not... <laughs> <laughs> it's not that it's of not the world view. Of that of the world view of YouTube, <laughs> me tube, we tube, we all tube. Yeah, it's just just two idiots that went, you know, sometimes <laughs> schooling. All right, so don't forget to check us out on uh, Instagram and Facebook and also on the Locals Net and also um, uh, like and subscribe. Tell everybody about it. Tell your friends, family, and coworkers. Yeah, we'll, and, we'll uh, put all the links in the description. Yes. So uh, we will be back again with another video. So Boss 1, Boss 2, signing off. We out. Get in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Before you go, don't forget to check out our end screen where you'll see links to our previous video, a video YouTube thing you like, and a link to our second channel.